Hi everybody, this morning I decided to uh, look with you how to uh, brush your teeth, floss and use the product. I'm talking about like uh, hydrogen peroxide and uh, torrent powder. So I'll do it in my mouth because sometimes the patient they don't like to do it in front of the camera. So I'll do it myself so you can see how we do it. So I want you to start with first month brushing with hydrogen peroxide so it's normal hydrogen peroxide three percent okay but we'll reduce it to one percent so it is safe okay so you take a little glass little glass hydrogen peroxide have a little bit of water then i put one cap of hydrogen peroxide one cap here in the little glass and then two cap of water once two times so we have your new toothpaste we're going to use it for some months when you are as you want your gum to um, to cure to heal correctly now we use toothbrush normal toothbrush but sensitive one or soft one ultra soft toothbrush ultra soft okay so I open it okay have a little water clean it and then I use it this hydrogen peroxide 1% it's very safe put the toothbrush in it and use best modified technique okay so best modified I show it to you it's like I want to go like 45 degree 45 degree okay applying half on the gum half on the tooth okay then I use a little vibration half a second vibration then roll vibration roll vibration roll vibration roll you do this four times okay so we do that in the back vibration roll vibration roll vibration roll vibration roll Again, vibrate, roll, vibrate, roll, vibrate, roll, vibrate, roll, until the front tooth, okay? Vibration, roll. And then you rinse a little bit. You can spit the excess. And then you go to the other side, okay? Four times. Four times, vibration, roll, middle teeth, and last teeth. Vibration, roll, vibration, roll, vibration, roll. Then you spit the excess. Don't drink it. No, it's no good. Then you take some more. Then you do the inside. Inside the tooth. Inside, here. Yeah. Four times. Vibration roll, vibration roll, vibration roll, four times. Vibration roll, vibration roll, vibration roll. Do that four times. Spit the excess. Have some more. And you go to the last side. You go like this. It's a little difficult. Go like that. Four times. Four times. Four times. You do this for the upper teeth. And you do the same for the lower teeth. And when you you go 45 degrees, okay, you push real hard. Push real hard. Okay, like this. Four times. Four times. See how it goes like this. Push real hard, a soft brush, real hard. Go up, up, up. So you go here, here, and there. So going four times everywhere will make like you have a 96 stroke. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Have a new one, take some more. Here we are in this little area with the patient here. Okay, so patient they do it all the time, every appointment. Okay, like four times. You have to spit the excess and don't forget the inside. Inside here, one, two, push real hard, real hard. A sharp brush. Like this, like this, like this, like this, like this. Four times. You can angle it a little bit here and you finish everywhere. 
So you do this morning and night. It takes three to five minutes, morning and night. So we'll do that for all the treatment with hydrogen peroxide. One percent. We reduce to one percent. So normally my patients begin the first month. So if you have gum disease, gingivitis, periodontitis, stage one, stage two, stage three, you start with that one month. Okay? When you finish one month, you see your dentist every month. Okay? Have cleaning every month. <clears throat> Now the second month, you add the floss and you add the Torrens powder. So you fabricate Torrens powder. So I'll show you first, floss, brush your teeth and apply the Torrens powder, okay? So floss, use an easy floss, wax floss. You take one big yard of it, okay? Long one, because I want you to roll around your finger. So I'll show you how I do it. You take middle finger, three, three turns. Don't go too hard because it's gonna stop the blood in your finger. You go like this, take thumb and index. The other side you go once and take like this. So you have only uh, one inch, less than one inch, okay? So you take this, you just turn around and you go in between your teeth. I'll show you, okay? So you go like this, in between the teeth, push one side, push the other side, and get it out, okay? Now the important thing is you roll to have a new floss for the next tooth, like this. Another one, then you go to the next, then you roll all the time. Just get it in, one side, the other side, and get it out, okay? Yeah, like this, and then you go back the last tooth, okay? So don't be afraid. You pull the cheek, you go at the end of the last tooth, and you do this for the other side, you do the same for the lower, okay? Like this, get it in, just move a little bit and get it out. Inside, outside, you roll, I want you to roll so you have a new floss for each tooth so you don't contaminate the, the other tooth with the pathogen bugs and parasites, okay? So start in the front with the floss and you finish with the back teeth and you roll and have a new one for each tooth. So you begin the day with the floss, start flossing. After flossing, you do the toothbrush like I showed you, four stroke, 45 degree, 45 degree, outside and inside, okay? And then you finish the second month, you add Torrance powder. So Torrance powder is not, it's easy, but you have to make it. So you take baking soda and you take salt, okay? Simple salt, that's it, okay? So what you do, you have a nice little jar, like this one, for the patient I call it Torrance powder. You make six parts of Torrance powder, one part is salt, six parts of baking soda, okay? You mix it, I'll show you, I'll do it. So I take full box, it's gonna be easier like this, it's open, yes. So make sure everything is clean and nice. You take this baking soda powder. You see it's about, about half. So I fill it in one for six, okay? Six part baking soda, one little part, one little part of salt, six part baking soda. So I'll do the mix. So this is good for six months at least. So you pour the baking soda inside here. There it is. Yes. We have equivalent to six part. Okay, six part of baking soda. Now you add one part, just one little part of salt. Normal salt. I'll just pour it until the line, written line, 
So I put salt, one part, six part baking soda. Don't make it too hard for the first time, it's difficult. That salt, it, but it kills the parasite, kills the bacteria, kills the bad bacteria and the parasite. They explode, they break. So now you need a little uh, mixer. Don't take the coffee mixer because it's going to break. Have a separate mixer. So I put everything in there. Here, I put this in the mixer. So we mix the salt and the baking soda and make it smoother, okay? So I just take this mixer. Make sure it's two-part mixer. And we just turn it for one minute, okay? Just mix it. Add that a little bit. Just mix. Baking soda and salt. You do this for one minute. Very easy. Don't cost much. It's gonna cure your gums. It's gonna kill the bugs. Kill the very life. One minute. You help it a little bit. Yes. Good. Excellent. Good. Now you have your Torrance powder. It's called Torrance powder. It's used by Trevor Lyons in the 1980s. Still very good. All my patients did use this. Now watch if you have hypertension. If you have hypertension, watch it. See your doctor. If you can, there's no problem. Make sure you see your dentist every month during the first treatment year. Okay, so I have my toilet powder is completed. Then I can use this for the next six months. Okay? So you have a little bit like this. So first, you floss morning and night. You floss everywhere. You brush. Bass modified. And then you have the toilet powder in your gum. Don't put too much. It's like I forgot the little spoon, but have like one spoon of it, okay? Take one spoon, put, oh, that's too much. One spoon, one small spoon. Yes. And then what you do is with your wet finger, you apply the toilet powder on your gum. So you may even have a little bit. <laughs> I have to add some more now. You take the toilet powder, it goes like this and you put it on your gum, like this. With one finger, you put it everywhere. Now, instead of like brushing, you remove the bugs. Now, the tolerance powder, you put it inside the gum. It's like, like putting inside. So you take one time, you do the outside, lower, you go some more, like that. Yes, you take some powder, yeah. Everywhere inside, everywhere inside, and mostly the diseased teeth. If you have disease seen in the back, just put it in the back. Now it's going to be very salty, so you spit the excess. You spit the excess, but do not rinse. Do not rinse. Let it act for 10 to 15 minutes. Spit the excess. Spit the excess, don't worry. And then, you see it's a little salty, okay? Try to keep it at least 10 minutes. And uh, when you're doing this treatment, gingivitis, you do that for four or five months. Stage one, stage two, stage two periodontitis, do it for eight months, morning and night. Okay, when you're cured, you can do it once a day and the other time in the day use normal toothpaste, the one you like, once a day. If it's very difficult, use it two times a week for life. So it kills the parasites right on. If you get the parasite from water, from kissing, from the dog or whatever, just do it two times a week at least. If you can, do it once a day. 
but during treatment, okay, stage one is sometime five months.